and action. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Neek and I'm going to be doing a fall haul. Um, we not doing this again today. Like we not doing 50 takes again today. Like we not about to do that. So get it together, boo. So today I'm going to be doing a fall haul and it's gonna be featuring a lot of different brands um, like Burlington, Zaffle, Buffalo Exchange, which is a thrift store here in Long Beach that I visit from time to time to pick up different stuff. And then also H&M uh, as well. Another brand uh, that I shop at is Ross as well but before we get into that go ahead and go down below click subscribe turn your notification bell so you are notified when I do upload new content okay so um yeah let's go ahead and get started the first item is this kind of dress shirt kind of thing and I picked it up at Ross and it was $9.99. It was $9.99 and I don't know what brand this is. It says Doobie Doo. <laughs> I don't know what brand that is, but it looked really cute. I like the little um, stripe detailing. It reminds me a lot of um, Adidas. So I was like, you know what, this will be cute with like some thigh high boots. Um, once again, I got this at Ross. I don't know if you'll be able to find it in your area, but it wouldn't hurt to look. Next, I went on a Pretty Little Thing and I bought these pants, but I don't know why I always when I put up some light, it makes me look dark, but anyway. Um, I bought these pants from Pretty Little Thing and they're yellow floral paper bag skinny trousers is what's the name of them. And then also if I can find the links to any of the stuff that I am um, finding online or anything like that, I will list them down below in the description box. But yeah, I bought these yellow trousers. Um, they're kind of a, a good length on me but the waist is way too big like I could stand to take it in like a couple of inches I was just kind of guesstimating on the sizing because I know some my butt is like super huge and when I buy something in a specific size it'll make my butt look a lot flatter than it actually is because it does not fit my butt but it does fit my waist and that's usually the problem that I always have when I'm buying like jeans or trousers or like um, even really dressy pants. Um, I always have trouble with the sizing. But yeah, I got these. They were cute. I don't remember the price. Um, I think they're about, I'm, I'm not even going to guess. It's going to be down in the description box. I got with this cute skirt. Um, I'm going to be doing actually a Sunday Vibes lookbook um, here in the next couple of weeks of um, items that I would wear to church or um, in a business setting or something like that. And it will be featuring some of the items that I bought today as well as some items that I already have in my closet. And um, yeah, you could look forward to that video. But this skirt, um, I, it was, I saw it on the, let me tell you what brand it's from or what site it's from. It's from Zaffle. I bought this from Zaffle and I believe it was like $14 or $15.99. I hate that. That's the only thing I don't like about buying stuff on Zaffle is when you get it um, delivered to your house, like the pricing is not on it. Like sometimes I like to know what I spent on an item just to make sure that you know that it's worth it. But yeah, it is really cute. I can fit it um, cause it's one size. So it has like a stretchy elastic band. Um, really cute, got that. Um, moving on, I bought this jean jacket from 
um, the Isabel Bedoya collection. If I can find the site and the details and all that, I will link it down below. Got this jean jacket. It's really, it's really simple, but the thing that really attracted me to it is that it has blessed on the back and that just like really resonates with me so i was like oh that is super cute i and i got it a little over well i believe it's already come to a little oversized um i got a medium and um i went to disneyland i got these cute little um pins put on it and i put on it and uh yeah just really gives it a little bit more edge because i love winnie the pooh and yeah i got that it fits really good um and it's kind of sturdy it has um good material on it as well the next item i purchased was this skirt and i got this from burlington and the price was 10.99 i paid 10.99 for this skirt and I don't really go for a lot of geometric shapes on my clothing, but I was like, you know what? We gonna do something, you know, out of the norm. And I picked up this skirt. It's really cute. And then it has green in it, which is my favorite color, which is another reason why I picked it up. But yeah, um, it fits me really well. It's in a size small. Um, but yeah, I think this will be really cute with like some you know some heels or just you know a cute little jacket or something when you just want to look dressy for church or you know for work or something like that so I did pick that up as well the next item is this faux leather jacket and I did get this from H&M so I got this from H&M or H&M <laughs> And um, I've already worn it um, a couple of times. It really does keep me warm, which is what I really like about it. And then it has like this little like ribbed kind of detailing on the sleeve here. And then um, I do like the way that it fits and the pockets um, aren't really that deep, which is unfortunate because I do like to carry stuff in my pockets. But yeah, um, I got this jacket. Um, I believe it was $40 from H&M. Um, I don't remember exactly what the price was, but all of that information, if I can find it, will be down below anyways. The only purse I uh, actually ended up purchasing is this bad boy right here. So I got this purse from Zaffle. I know it's been making its way around YouTube on many different holes but I purchased it because it is actually the perfect size for me because usually when I go out places I'm taking my bill and out like a huge bag or my Michael Kors backpack or something like that and I wanted to kind of convert down to something a little bit smaller which is perfect really perfect <laughs> this perfect size like um so it just kind of condenses down and then it has like this strap that you can add to it to make it like a crossbody, which I'm all about. Um, especially when I'm going places like Disneyland or, you know, just adventure parks or anything like that because I don't feel like carrying nothing. But at the end of the day, I'm going to really go to sleep. But, uh, yeah, um, it's really cute, um, really boxy. And then it just says newsboy on the front. Super cute. And then I also love because you you already know. You already know what my favorite color is. So I even got to say that in the comment. But I'ma say it anyway. So my favorite color is on it as well. So that's another reason why I had to pick this bad boy up. Um the next item I got from Zapple is these white trousers i saw them featured on patricia bright's videos and i was like oh those are really cute and come to find out they're really transparent like i can literally see through them they're like 
paper, <laughs> as she would put it. But yeah, um, it's, it does have a less, ugh, ugh, really, an elastic um, waistband. So if it's like a one size fits all type of thing. The same with the skirt that I bought from Zaffo as well. Um, but yeah, it's super cute. Um, this will probably be in a lookbook as well on, you know, ways that it can be styled and all of that. Good stuff. The next item from Zaffo is this cute, like, <sighs> this shirt. Like, let me take a moment for it because I don't know who this shirt is going to fit, but most likely it's not going to fit me. Um, as you can see, like, girl, I was crying. I was literally crying when I saw this um, come out of my package. And I'm just like, what? It, and on the inside, it doesn't have any tags to let you know which side is the front and which side is the back, I guess, because it's the same. And... I don't remember how much it was and they didn't include like a package slip or anything so they let me know how much it was unfortunately but um if I can find the link and it can fit you it will be down below I do like the the reason why I picked this is because I do like the ribbed kind of detailing that it has um, I was hoping it would be a bit longer but I guess I could just pair it with like some high waist jeans or something if I can get into it. <laughs> Next item I did wear as well because some of these items I just could not wait to try on and wear is this gray shirt right here. It kind of has like this marbling like tri-colored material um, and it has like speckles of white in it. And then I do really like the crisscross detailing on it as well. It just gives it a little bit more edge and just um, as opposed to it just being a plain black, gray, and white or whatever color this is shirt. And I purchased it from Ross and I believe it was like $10. So I was just like, you know what? Yeah, I need more, you know, kind of staple or plain tops to pair with like my jeans or my skirts or trousers or anything like that or high waist jeans so I just went ahead and picked this bad boy up the next top actually I'm not gonna do another top I'm gonna do this other jean jacket <laughs> I just I just can't I can't stop buying them I can't stop buying jean jackets and I do admit I do have a problem um <laughs> I bought this jean jacket um this one fits a little bit more fitted to you as opposed to being oversized like the blessed um jean jacket I showed earlier um and it's just kind of plain um and it has like two pockets on the front and then um, I bought this from Buffalo Exchange, um, which is a thrift store here in Long Beach off of 2nd Street. Um, it is a really good store. They do buy and sell um, gently used clothes. Like you can bring, I guess, items I've never done it myself personally, but I would assume that it would. you could just bring your items in and then they would look them over and give you a price on how much they would buy them from you from. Buy them from you from, what? buy them from you for how like however much and um, this is a size small and then I bought this jacket for $27 I know that's a bit expensive for a thrift store but I just feel like I absolutely needed to have it which is the reason why I bought it um, but yeah it just fits really well the pockets are pretty good size um, and I'm probably gonna add like some patches that I bought from Old Navy to it, just to give it a little bit more um, character. The last skirt that I bought was, let me go ahead and zip her up though. She got her back out right now. Shoot, hold on, let me help her out. This green 
skirt. It's kind of like a midi skirt. It's really, really cute. And it's more of like an olivey color, which I love. Like, I love all shades of green except for like lime green, but this one right here, I just, I just couldn't. And then the back has like this gold zipper that goes all the way down the bottom. And this is a size six. And I believe this was $16.99 and I purchased it from Burlington and the material is so good on this like and it has like an elastic -y, just a little bit of stretch but um, yeah I did wear this one already to church because I just couldn't wait the next item is a jacket that unfortunately already has a stain on it I know but it's this white jacket right here. Ignore the stain. But um, yeah, it's this white jacket right here. It's really cute. It has like, um, unfortunately you can't button it up, but uh, it has like these like silver buttons going down on each side and it just looks really cute and feels really good on, so which is the reason why I bought it. Um, this is in a size large and I purchased this from Ross. That's where I got it from. I got it from Ross and yeah, I believe this was about $20. Most of the stuff at Ross costs like $20 or less unless it's like a new item, I guess that they just got in. Um, next item is this cute cute top like girl when I talk about this top and when I have this top on I got a lot of compliments on this top already but yeah I got this top from Ross as well big surprise right <laughs> so I got this top from Ross um, it has like a keyhole uh, in the back and it's a size medium and then it has like this kind of v-neck I'm gonna try to show you here this v-neck type of opening in the front and it's super cute it's really flowy and it goes really well with like some high-waisted jeans I'm just saying mostly anything looks good with high-waisted jeans I'm just saying though and the last, second to last item that I purchased was this yellow jacket right here. And I haven't worn it yet because I just want like my fit to be just on point when I got it on. But yeah, it's um from Mark New York, Andrew Mark, and then it's I guess supposed to retail for $57 but I paid $40 for this um but yeah it's super cute it has like this cloth material on the in underlying of the sleeves as well as like the side as well and then it has like this cute like zipper right here the pockets are really the pockets are really deep like and then it just looks super well constructed and just put together. The last item, drum roll. Alright, the last item is this cute top right here. So it kind of reminds me of the top that I have on, which I always it reminds people I guess of Netflix and chill so but it's just says chill on it um, but this one says coffee and chill and it's long sleeves which I really like too and then it's kind of a brighter red as you can probably tell already and then I really do like this neckline though <sighs> it's super cute like it's, I got it in an extra large, which I didn't mind because like I feel like I just needed to have this shirt. And this is how much I paid for it. $8.99. $8.99. 
$8.99. How can you go wrong with that? Like, how can you just like pass, see it, pass it up and just like leave out the store? I just couldn't. So yeah, I got this shirt. It's super cute. Um, I don't even know how I'm gonna style it yet, but it's gonna be cute. It's gonna be cute. But yeah, guys, that wraps up this video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Please let me know down below in the comment section if any of these items that you would love to get your hands on. But remember, always be yourself, always love yourself, and be blessed. Bye. Bye. All right, really, really though, bye.